Hello everybody, it is Turkey Dirk. I'm on the test server, mainly to test this thing. Blockchain. What the hell? We all know it, we all hated it. Now it does something completely different. Now over here you can see I got a lot of stuff lined up. Got some grills, got some armor. And let's see what happens. Hello Vicky, how are you doing my friend? Boom! <laughs> okay. Notice that. So the first thing about this new blockchain is it just destroys things that are passed through. The other thing is notice how it seems to have some penetration deal going on. Let's see that again. All right. So is it actually a scorpion? Is the blockchain the new scorpion? Well, damn, that's devs. That's one way to make it viable. <laughs> I mean, if you want us to use a new blockchain, just say so. I mean that, yeah. Yeah. So with each shot from blockchain, there's eight shells launched in a dense group. Okay. The damage is huge, 160%. Reloading time is increased. That's pretty damn good. So they changed the perk. Now the weapon partially ignores the transparency of parts and deals more damage to the parts that can be penetrated. Excellent. So as you can see, first of all, they're just going to shoot grills off. That's scary. Grills are where our weapons are, and now they will be gone completely. So that is pretty terrifying. Now, the second thing is they seem to have these eight pellet kind of a thing. So what I'm thinking is happening is it's not penetrating. It's not shooting through and then causing damage to the other parts like the scorpion would. I think it's those eight pellets. One blows up the first one. The second pellet goes through nothing and hits the second one. The third one goes through two nothings and it's the third one. See what I mean? So I think it's just a matter of those eight pellets kind of somehow in a way they weren't intended seeming like they're going through uh, multiple armor pieces like it's penetrating like it's a 88 or something this wording does not quite say that it should do that yeah so they're gonna delete any kind of grill thing what about frames though i wonder i'm glad i asked so here's some frames which are passed through last i checked right and here's some light frames that are definitely very passed through all right got a bunch of frames got a bunch of frames let's see if this passes through Boom! <laughs> Holy crap. Those are frames, guys. Uh, frames are important. That's where your wheels are. <laughs> wow. Uh, blockchain out the gate might be too damn good. I'm gonna do a thing. You know, I'm kind of happy that blockchain finally does what we thought it was gonna do. We thought it was gonna be amazing, and then it was total crap. All right, so here's what you're gonna do, my friends. You're gonna take the guys out, you're gonna undermount them between meats, okay? You taking notes? That's what you're gonna do. You're gonna come over here, and all you're gonna do is walk out the people and delete their frames. <laughs> delete frame, delete frame. That's what you're gonna do, people. Bam, frames are gone. The blockchain is buffed in so many ways. The reloading is increased, the damage is increased, they do more damage to grill bits. They completely destroy them. They're functionally armor penetrating. They delete frames, anything else. And you don't need a photon anymore. Before you had to. You had to have triggers or something else. You don't need heating, Brandon. Uh, their perk has nothing to do with heat. So you don't need a photon. You don't need triggers. You don't need the aurora. You don't really need an incinerator. You don't need anything, man. You just need these things and you are good to go. So... There's not a whole lot else. There's nothing else to talk about here, guys. So these smaller cannons are the damage is increased, which they need to be. Spitfires are good. They've always been good. The ruptures, they increase the durability, which was never what I really wanted anyway. So hell with that. Fafner, durability is increased. Not too bad. Storm damage is reduced. Why the storm then? All right, game. Do you just not like all cannons anymore? Grenadiers are nerfed. Speed and durability is nerfed. Annihilator durability is nerfed. Now the drone changes its position once every three seconds. So it's kind of easier to hit. They don't move around so much. If you know me, you know I hate drones anyway. But I also don't mind balance changing between different kinds of weapon classes. I feel like it's better to let the players learn how to deal with drones. And then you'll have less drones. Rather than just nerf the drones. Because... Now you're kind of more 
just making certain things that were fine, making them garbage so you can't use them anymore. So I still think let the players really try to rework this and try to find their own solutions, like bringing sparks to the battle. So yeah, uh, Corey mentioned something. Uh, this is the test server only. So we don't know. This is a extreme rework that makes me really, really want to try it. Really want to try it. Is this a hoax? Could be. This could very well be a hoax. In other news, we are following the Wabbit. So we get this crazy guy over here and you get this banner. So uh, if you so choose, now, what I love about Crossout is the minute they have this Easter egg kind of hunt, immediately someone comes up with a map. Like, immediately. Now, I have freaking gone all the way around the block four times. So yeah, I've done all that. I've shot the ones that are on the buildings. I found one that was over here behind the truck. Right over there. And I've looked at the map too, and for the life of me, I have three more. I've gone through the whole map, and I have no idea. I cannot find these freaking eggs. So now I'm reduced to just kind of riding around, shooting in the bushes. I got two of them just that way, just by shooting into the bushes like that. Wow, why did I not learn my lesson from the cameras? Where I just went off and just shot cameras as I saw them. No, you have to follow a map and cross it off as you go, otherwise you're dead. I think there's supposed to be one over here. Is that it? Oh, is that it? That looks like an egg. I think I got it. I got it. Is that it? Yay! <laughs> wow, I found it. So get yourself a map first and then cross out the ones that you find. Otherwise, you'll be like me and you will never get the last two. It's just really sad. I shot up the brown truck already. This one, right? I already shot this one up and destroyed it and didn't find any egg in there, but I'll do it again. I'm happy to destroy things just for the hell of it, so yeah. All right, Mr. Truck, I got a beef. I got a bone to pick with you. It's right there. I shot this truck before, but not the whole thing. What does it look like anyway? That's a pretty disgusting looking egg. Ew, I don't know why they bought. Okay, so there's one. Oh God, now one egg. Wait a minute, what is that? <laughs> oh my God, I found it. Oh my goodness. Guys, you had faith in me, Trinima. Thank you, guys. I found the Easter eggs. I found the Easter eggs. Away. I got them all. The present is ready for you, but the rabbit, it seems, is nowhere to be found. It was with you all along, you idiot. This guy, who I will temporarily use. And then you have a banner background, which is... This one? And I guess that means I have a logo, right? What is this one? Yay, look at that. <laughs> Those are scary bunnies. So I will see you later. Enjoy and please stay safe and da da da, stay at home. Oh, and uh, avoid people and wash your hands. Don't drop that duck duck. Hey, don't drop that duck.